The Native Americans of the Northwest Coast used to live in villages made up of long wooden houses all lined up facing the beach. Some villages had only a few houses, but some were so big they stretched for a mile along the beach. The houses were quite large because many families would live together. Some of their homes were painted with beautiful designs and some had carved totem poles standing in front. The Northwest Coastal Native Americans carved totem poles to tell stories about their families. When a totem pole was finished, the owner gave a big pole raising potlatch, that is what they call a party, and would invite hundreds of guests from other villages. Totem pole carvers were incredible artists, respected by everyone. They used tools made of stone, seashells, and wood. The carver would spend hours listening to the family's history. Then, the carver would draw a design in charcoal right onto a tree trunk that had been prepared. Then, he would use the drawn design to guide his carving. Even today, you can see totem poles in our community. Our local Lummi tribal nation even sent a special totem pole to New York after the 2001 attack on America. Today, the coastal Indians live modern lives, but they can be proud of their heritage and we can be grateful to live in a place with such a rich history. Created using Powtoon.